And the fat guy returns for another unboxing. With not just one box, or a, well, one package, but three of them. It's crazy, I get nothing for weeks and three turn up at once. So anyway, let's open this small one first. I'm pretty sure I know what's in here, but... Let's open it now. Alright, there's a letter. Let's see if there's anything else in there. There's some bits and pieces there. I'll read this out. Oh, there's an address on there, so I better not show that. So what we've got here... Radio coils! That I'm gonna do... I'm gonna use in my later Superhead experiments. So thanks for that. Right, well... Before we open this, let's just open this box here. Now, this is crazy how they package these things. There's only a few bits and pieces in here, but they send it in a huge box. It's, it's crazy. I just need to get my scissors. And let's open this thing. <coughs> I haven't been up for long. <coughs> get a day when your throat just will not clear no matter how time you clear it? I mean, how many times you clear it? I have that all the time. I just don't know where all that stuff comes from. And I clear my throat and two minutes later again I've got to clear it again. Right, okay. Oh, another address. It's almost like there's nothing in here, but trust me, there is. Packaging. And more packaging. And finally... So, let's see what we got here then. Got some chips for some upcoming projects and experiments I want to do. So we got uh, What are these now? I've forgotten what I ordered. I think these are, yeah, these are TL494s. Couple of those. I've got some IR3844s, I think they are IR, aren't they? Or something like that. But UC3844 or something like that. I've forgotten whether they're... But anyway, let's see what else we got. Some MOSFET drivers. Uh... And there we are, IR2110. I'm sure I ordered more diodes than that. Let's see, we got uh, ultra fast one amp 600 volt diodes. And because I never have enough of these, some IC sockets. Right, so let's put them back to that side. <coughs> and finally, in a much more appropriate sized packaging. Some of the stuff I ordered. So I'm just going to pull this out on the bed. Make sure there's nothing else in there. Let me get rid of that. And that. Some various bits and pieces. We'll go into that in just a minute. The potentiometers. I'm sure I ordered more than those. Yeah, those are the 10 days. Oh, that's why the others have fallen out. So, we've got... 
whole bunch of resistors here and all kinds of different values. They're a bit bigger than I thought they would be, but that doesn't matter. Got some 10k potentiometers. Over there, let's just uh, pour all this stuff out. So, UF 4007 diodes, 47k potentiometers. There should be some 4.7k's as well. Yep, 4.7k or 4k7. Just some more NE555s. Oh, there's some other potentiometers here. I don't know what all of those. 22Ks. And some capacitors. Got a whole bunch of 1 microfarad polyester capacitors. And some rather nice 1 microfarad polypropylene film capacitors. So there we go, there's today's unboxing, now I'm going to get on with some projects. Oh and before I go, about the problem I was having with my home network, with I was getting extremely slow speeds copying from one computer to the other but not the other way around, well, sort of got it sorted out now. I don't know whether it's just randomly decided to behave again or if it was your suggestions that I tried that actually fixed the thing. But, it's working again, so, still not as good as it could be, but it's a lot better, so, I'm just going to say thanks, and, uh, oh, my stuff is falling down, anyway, so anyway, thanks for your suggestions and everything, it seems to be working again, and anyway, I've got some more projects to get on with now, so I'll just stop this recording, and until next time, goodbye.